Sigo maharaze kwa habu ya kawo mba kwa bwa tuka fara ya dai. Wele bu adu hari yehi dongweki ya mahaesh. Welcome, my friend. I appreciate you coming all this way. Oh, do forgive me for not shaking hands. My hospitality exceeds my reach. <laughs> Before we begin, I'll ask that you keep an open mind to what you're about to hear. The source of my information is, um, unconventional. A good source of intel only needs to be reliable. I assure you, the information couldn't be from a more legitimate origin. You are not a Jedi, but you can still experience the Force's mysteries with my help. Concentrate with me. Focus your mind. Feel the Force around us. Hear its echoes. I didn't come here to stand in a circle and chant nonsense. Control your emotions. Release your fear. Then, you will see. She is here. A Jedi without physical form. Her body is long dead, but her wisdom, her essence, lives on. When you said your source was unconventional, I wasn't picturing a... whatever that is. Most Jedi go their entire lives without experiencing anything like this. You are special. The darkness will consume all it touches. Stars will burn black. Ashes raining on lifeless worlds. Everything ends. The prisoner holds the darkness at bay, lost inside it for 300 years. His strength will fail. Then he will become the darkness. This prisoner has been fighting the Empire for centuries. How is he still alive? The bond weakens, my friend. I'll take things from here. He's told me many things. Revealed the existence of an Imperial prison in the constantly shifting Maelstrom Nebula, and a way to get there. The only way to navigate the Maelstrom is using a Gree computer hidden at an Imperial fortress. We need that computer to free the Jedi prisoner. Sounds like a great way to get myself killed. I would not throw you into the fire unless I had no other option. The fortress we're invading is on the planet Taral V, enemy territory protected by Imperial warships. Too many to fight. But we have a captured Imperial shuttle that can sneak past the sentries. It's waiting for you in the hangar. No offense, but I'd feel a lot more comfortable invading Imperial space in my own starship. You wouldn't make it past the first Imperial cruiser. This is the only way. Our fleet will hide at the system's edge, so I can monitor your mission and guide you. If something goes wrong, we'll come running. Now go to the shuttle, my friend, and may the Force be with you. 